much is too much for a new drink. Good morning. It's the first day of my first vlogmas. Never done this before, so this will be a new experience, and we'll see if I can do it every day. Today is Friday, December 1st. I just have to wash my hands. Sorry. Why do you have to wash your hands? You just have to. But why do you have to wash your hands? <laughs> Explain to me why. <laughs> Okay, that's completely unnecessary. That is not to do Anyway, today is Friday, so it's, you know, a school day. First vlogmas is going to be... Ooh, it's dark. Probably just the morning. Just the morning and maybe a little bit of the afternoon. Honestly, I'm not playing this out very well. I, I will come up with a plan eventually, but... Right now I'm just coming, you know, it's just straight off the top. So, Jen, let's get this, these lunch boxes ready for school. I don't know what I'm going to cook for breakfast. Actually, I do know. We have some frozen breakfast sandwiches, so I'm going to put those in. I didn't clean up the kitchen entirely last night. Usually I like to, but go get ready. Like, bruh, go get ready. No, go get ready. Okay. Lotion and go get dressed. Uh, usually I like to clean the kitchen before I go to bed, but I have not been feeling well. Nobody's been feeling well in our house. Um, I have an ear, like I had a really bad ear infection. I still have it. I'm only on like day three of my antibiotics. So yeah, I've been out of commission a little bit, but I'm making it do. But let's get the kitchen a little tidy before I start packing lunch boxes. So you can tell by one's face how tired they are. Check back in when the dishes are done and I start packing lunches. How people can drop so much food on the floor. I don't understand it. Within one meal. This is just one meal. Seriously, this much the sandwiches. And so my husband pre-made these sandwiches so that it would be easy on school days to just pop it in, warm it up for 10 minutes, and then breakfast is done. <coughs> Good morning. Pop these in. They start. Okay. Done with that. Now, the real problem, lunch. What are we to do about lunch? All right, it's 6.57. I would like for everything to be done by now because pretty much everybody needs assistance getting ready in the morning isn't that right alex we have four kids so three of them are school age our kids are eight seven five and two obviously the eight eight and seven year old for sure should be able to get themselves ready in the morning it's a little challenging i think it's the area of growth it's something we're really trying to grow and develop them in from school the past two years so they're still kind of getting in the groove of like hey we got to get up and go and all that stuff so i'm trying to give that some grace but still they should be responsible got some leftovers for our oldest because he's very particular he doesn't like everything he likes to eat dinner for lunch and he doesn't like to eat normal kid lunches so he doesn't like peanut butter and jelly sandwiches you know the basics he wants carnitas and rice pasta you know Sleeping Beauty. Wake up. It's a beautiful day in the neighborhood. Beautiful day for a neighbor. Would you be mine? Could you be mine? <laughs> wake up. Wakey, wakey. Eggs and bakey. <laughs> She's our late sleeper. She loves to sleep and I love that, but you gotta get up because this is good. Okay, I'm coming back in five minutes. Oh yeah, you better be uh, brushing your teeth. 
See you in a little bit. Good morning. Hello. Say good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Say good morning. Do you know what Vlogmas is? I do. I do. It, it, it means, it means, um, is it like maybe recording or something? Yes. Video no, Vlogmas is. vlogging Christmas. <laughs> That's basically it. Are you ready? I will be recording them every day until Christmas. We'll see if everyone is on board. Time check. 722. We're still decent on time. Breakfast is done. Done. Hurry up! Let's go say bye. Hit the front door. It's a very chaotic movie. Very usual. Daddy. Alex forgot his water. Say bye. Bye. See you next time. See you next time. Bye. Evan, you need to get your wall out. Oh no, he knocked it. He's not. As usual, that was a very rushed, frazzled. <laughs> Come on, talk to me. Listen to me. <laughs> We're gonna have a good day, right? Are we gonna have a good day, yes or no? Just no. Let me, okay. You know what, I was just about to say, just let me know so I can know the real. No, we're not gonna have a good day? No. Okay, well at least I know what I'm in for. I want an egg. You want another egg? Yeah. So you want me to scramble another egg for you? Yeah. Oh, yeah. I'll be good. Okay. What? I'm going to help you. You're going to help me? Yeah. Okay, so I'm going to, I'm trying to have a relatively productive day today. I'm going to take this bookshelf down and I'm going to move it into our guest room slash office because I just don't like it in here. I want basically nothing in our bedroom. We're kind of, we're very low-key and slow moving with decorating. I'm not the best at decorating. Um, I just like a clean house. That's really my thing. But let's get this bookshelf down. We're going to get all the books off and then move it to the other room. <laughs> uh, yeah, I don't think you're going to be able to help me. Well, maybe you can. this book as a as a um i guess a wedding gift our first christmas together someone got this for us and basically every year uh, for christmas you write down kind of some pivotal memories Thing is not stressed. Tom is not stressed. Leave me alone. Daddy, 
Leave mommy alone. slowly putting up the Christmas decorations. The kids started last Saturday, no, last Friday. Yeah. They, that's it needs the some first it needs some it did. needs some fixing. Yes. Yeah. We're going to do some tweaking today. It's not going to be fully done. But we're going to get the, the structure up. All right. Just, just go with it. Go ahead. What's up? We're going to partially decorate or put the lights up on this tree. And then we have another tree over here. Here's a decision we need to make. We need to vote. What color should our Christmas tree lights be? I think we should do white, red, and green. Okay, white, red, and green. White, red, and green is blue. Raise your hand if you want white and blue. Raise your hand if you want white and blue. Raise your hand if you want white, red, and green. Raise your hand if you want white. We all want white, red, and green. You are bribing him. You're bribing. Do not. You cannot accept bribes in this. It's no. A bribe is not allowed in the voting process. Ready? Vote. Okay. No. Okay, if you want white, if you want white, raise your hand. Do you see his face? He's not even. What you do, we're going to do one tree, uh -huh. white, red, and green, uh -huh. and one tree all white. No. We're going to do white, red, and green for our Christmas tree colors. We have another Christmas tree. I want to compromise and put that one all white. I'll probably do that one. Um, let me know what are y'all what color are y'all doing your Christmas tree what colors or color are you making your Christmas tree put it in the comments I don't have to think because I know how much it costs all right how much Tim wants to buy a new tree this Go tree ahead, is why. awful it's all it looks all, all it's trees terrible. look awful it does look awful, awful. you're right I mean, it's, it does my it looks gosh <laughs> look at that it looks even worse <laughs> You have to pretty it up. So how much? <clears throat> you have to do tinsel. Listen, you, have you gotta to do add fifty dollars worth of worth of leaves just to make it look decent. How much is too much for a new tree? Yep. Put it in the comments. Pre lit tree is only eighty bucks right now. But is it slim? <laughs> eighty bucks. Not is slim. It slim. Not slim. Because that's honestly, that's the problem we have right now. Both of these trees are slim. We've always had slim trees because uh -huh. we've usually lived in smaller spaces. Oh. Except for in Chicago. Remember when I bought that Christmas tree? And I was <laughs> and put it on top, of our, <laughs> on top of our Toyota Camry because he was allergic to real trees. We tried to be very festive our first year that we lived in our new house some years ago and we bought this it was so pretty we set it up in our corner wrapped it, in, wrapped it back in saran wrap <laughs> he started sneezing having an allergy just an allergy attack and we had to sit it back thankfully they took it back but so now that's why we do artificial trees but are we going to buy a new tree yes compliments to the chef good job and the other chef and the other chef Thank you.